Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer, and my idea for this that I wrote down was support has leveled up. Okay. Now what I mean by this is in Battlefield 5, um, support I think was an undervalued class at the start. And I think support has been an undervalued class in you know, this kind of different Battlefield games. Because take a game like Battlefield 4. I like if I played someone like support or engineer where you're repairing, let's say, support. Yeah, you can give ammo, but you found a bunch of ammo in Battlefield 4 anyway, so it was very rare you actually needed to give someone ammo. And take a class like engineer. Everyone's vehicles got blown you. up instantly anyways. You know, vehicle combat kind of sucked to me in Battlefield 4. So you really had no use of an engineer repairing vehicles. Maybe you did with an LAV or something like that, but, you know, it's very rare. Then look at Battlefield 1. Battlefield 1... You had a lot of ammo, and as support, you didn't need to give people ammo. Like a sniper, as I was, a, I was a sniper a lot of the times in that game, right? It's very hard for me to run out of ammo as a sniper, or even like a medic. You know, sometimes you did need that ammo, but you had so much ammo, dude. It was like, why even play support for the ammo? Then you could just pick up a different weapon and use it, right? I mean, in Battlefield One, it's not like Battlefield Five where you unlock stuff for the weapons. You unlock stuff for the class. So there was really no point in, oh, this is my Selt Slaughter 1916, and I'm never gonna drop this, baby. You know, there was just, there was no, wow, ooh, it's boingy. Uh, there's no reason to do that. You know, it's like, oh, I need a new weapon, pick up this. You know, and if you played all the classes, it didn't matter what weapon you picked up, because you used it anyways. But now in Battlefield 5, support with the ability to repair vehicles and give ammo in Battlefield 5 where you need ammo and you can give that um the big box with the gear you know so you get the rocket launcher the smoke grenade launcher back that changes the game a lot like support not only can they do shotgun LMG MMG right you can make it whatever range you're missing in a squad you can do it's awesome Support has some fun weapons to use. You know, they're not just all big LMGs with 200 rounds in the, the you know, you know, some, there's still some big LMGs with 150 rounds. There's also the smaller ones that are more like assault rifles and the medium ones, you know, you got shotguns. I mean, shotguns on support, I didn't expect to happen, but they did, and it was a great decision, right? Because now you have this dynamic where let's say you have a squad full of medics. They're gonna need to be up close, and you can pop them ammo, right? Let's say you have a squad of assault. You have that option of being longer range, so you're back with them and giving them ammo for the rockets. Or snipers, your support, I don't know how you're gonna be friends with a sniper other than, oh, spawn on you, here's your bullets, you run away, do your thing. But really, support, I like where it's headed. I like that it's not just a class that you kind of want to play as. Now it's like, okay, it's support. You're going to get points. You're going to do great. And then the fortifications. You can build up the fortifications fast, too. That's just the cherry on top that really makes me want to play support. And then the, I mean, the suppression assist that you can get as support is amazing with the spotting. I just Support now really got a bunch of little nerfs, which collectively make it a really good class in Battlefield Five and a viable class in Battlefield. I hope that they actually keep this system for the future Battlefield games for support, because I really like it. Let me know what you think about support in the comments below, guys. Do you play support? Support, even though I've been a sniper, all of my Battlefield kind of, in my Battlefield games, I've always played a sniper. I leveled up support to level 21st in Battlefield 5. That was the first class I maxed out. So yeah, that's it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, you can tell me in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new for more Battlefield 5 videos. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games, and I will see you in the next episode, stream, vlog, or Instagram post of whatever I decide to make.